get this error message from Logic Pro and the error says error while you're trying to synchronize audio and MIDI. Now I will guide you on how to resolve this problem. Make sure to follow these instructions very carefully. Now, why do you get this error in Logic Pro? You will usually get this error when your CPU is under heavy load or being pushed too hard. If this happens, the audio glitches and crackles. Then a seemingly random sample rate appears causing a playback to stop. Now here's how to resolve this issue. First, try saving the project, close down Logic Pro and then open it again. Now if you've done so, but you're still facing again the same issue, now try the steps here. Try increasing the buffer size. Try increasing your buffer size to like 1032. Open Logic Pro, then go to Preferences, and then select Audio, then click on Devices, then adjust the buffer sizes. Now if you've increased your buffer size, but are still facing again the same issue, try using less CPU intensive plugins. Also, turn off CPU heavy processing on the stereo bus while you still are composing and arranging. Also, bones in place of freeze tracks that are fairly settled. You can turn on the CPU meter in the transport bar to see if you are peaking. If it all fails, go through all your tracks and disable them one by one. You can add an on or off button to each track header by right clicking the track header components. Check if the problem goes away after disabling all tracks. If it does, re enable each track one at a time until the issue returns. This will help you identify which plugin is causing the problem. Now, if you followed all the instructions here correctly, but are still facing again the same issue, don't worry. The good news is that Apple have provided a fix for this problem. I'll just put the link to this page on the description of this video as on the comment section there down below. Make sure to follow these instructions very carefully step by step. And if it doesn't work, just check out this page from Apple. It can help you troubleshooting regarding this error. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope this story has helped you and see you next time.